All right, this is pretty cool. A new exhibit at the Curtis Memorial Library in Brunswick is honoring the work of a late children's book author and illustrator who frequently wrote about Maine. The exhibit featuring original artwork from Robert McCloskey's best-selling books, including Blueberries for Sal, Make Way for Ducklings, and One Morning in Maine. McCloskey grew up in Ohio, but he and his wife settled and raised their kids in Maine. He died in 2003 at the age of 88. At the exhibit, the public will be able to see sketches and notes McCloskey took during his book writing process. There are also murals painted throughout the library of his illustrations. Library staff will provide guided tours of the exhibit, or you can use your phone for a self-guided tour. It's the original illustrations. Um, it's so it shows um, his working documents. Uh, so if you look at some of these, they're pretty fabulous, but you can see his notes that are on there. You can see little mistakes that he made. You can see things he had in the artwork here and didn't end up in the book or vice versa. So it's really kind of fun to explore the pictures and then go and look at the books and how they ended up in the books. Very cool. There will also be events scheduled throughout the summer, including a book reading with Sally McCloskey, Robert's daughter, who inspired the book Blueberries for Sal. You can find a full list of events on the library's website, curtislibrary.com.